please drive to highlighted route. Last night we slept in a Camping World parking lot and there was crazy lightning and thunder the whole night. The, the Camping World's kind of like 20 minutes outside of Little Rock, Arkansas. All right, that's a good thing. We're in Little Rock, Arkansas. At this point we've done like three kinds of camping. You've got the RV park slash state park thing which is kind of out in the middle of nowhere and costs some money generally. And there's a uh, Harvest Host, which is like, we paid our membership, but we're able to stay there officially. And like, free parking lot of some kind, or like, just kind of crashed in some business that caters to RVs. We have not had to stay at a hotel or a motel yet. We were initially going to move from here to Hot Springs, Arkansas, but I got a package shipped from Amazon that arrives, arrived yesterday. We weren't able to pick it up. So instead we're gonna go up into the Ozark Mountains before heading back this way. Outside of Hot Springs, Arkansas, at a place called Lake Catherine, on a two mile hike to find a little swimming hole in the woods. It's kind of like the Shenandoah hike, except this time we're gonna make it. I don't wanna jinx us, but I think we can do two miles. So you might be wondering, how do you do laundry while living in a van? For this trip, we've got two dogs with us and they've got sheets and a dog bed and blankets. And we think that they picked up fleas along the way. So we are stopping off periodically at coin-operated laundromats. It's safe to say that they are not all the same. The ones in the remote towns tend to be kind of bombed out and you have to like bring $15 in quarters because the change machine generally doesn't work. But in college towns, they have awesome laundry mats. All of the machines take credit cards and the detergent is free because like, why not? So when you're living in a van and you're driving around the country, drive into a college town and find a 24 hour laundry mat. I'll show you how awesome this place is. So we spent the night outside of Fayetteville and our harvest host mentioned that the hometown of Walmart is 20 minutes up the road in a town called Bentonville. The town kind of feels like a little Pleasantville-esque. It's like Pee-wee's Adventure. It's like Pee-wee's Adventure. So we're gonna go check that out. <laughs> Take you up in boom, 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 bo
So the way you get stuff from Amazon while you live in a van is that you look up UPS stores and then you just get stuff shipped there. You don't even have to call ahead. We give them ID and they should charge you somewhere between three to five dollars. We got walkie talkies and I got a little car power inverter so that we can plug in our laptops and stuff off of the solar powered battery. It's officially happening. We're doing the full Clarence Thomas. We're crossing off sleeping in a Walmart from the list. It's good for a ride. I can confirm it is a Walmart. set up we're going to bed in the morning we will no longer be Walmart parking lot virgins Wish us luck. tomorrow we survived sleeping at Walmart we're officially ready to be on the Supreme Court a good deal of light coming through kind of like when we were at the camping world parking lot but it was free and now we're pretty close to our next stop so I would do that again. I have a confession to make. We did not sleep in the van last night. We slept in a hotel in Hot Springs, Arkansas. But for a good reason. It's Liz's birthday. And we wanted to do something a little bit special. So we're gonna spend the day exploring, checking out some woods, walking the dogs. And then we're gonna finish up with some massages on Bathhouse Row. Pay attention now, Zoltar has a word of wisdom for you this day. It says, a new turn of events will soon come about. You have a very trusting nature and are easily taken in by What so are you waiting for? Come friends. on over! That's why I don't trust nobody. <laughs> So we visited the Kwa, Kwa Pa uh, Mineral Cool Springs Baths. It's really fun. And we got massages. Part of Liz's birthday. It was originally just going to be her, but then she invited me to pay for my own massage as well. <laughs> uh, now we're going to get cocktail at what claims to be Arkansas's oldest bar. Let's see what it's like. <laughs>
all in all, Hot Springs, you were fun. The massage was good. We hit the road tomorrow. Texas. Good night, Arkansas. Love the way you walk, love the way you talk.